I would like to introduce you to Penelope. Penelope is a little bit like the main character in our book. Sometimes Penelope is a little bit grumpy, aren't you? This is Pom Pom Gets the Grumps. One morning, Pom Pom got out of bed on the wrong side. And then nothing was right. His blankie, Timmington, couldn't be found anywhere. Her rumpf, said Pom Pom. His baby brother, Boo Boo, was playing with his favourite toy. Bang, bang, bang. Her rumpf, said Pom Pom. Pom Pom's mummy sang silly, soppy songs all the way through breakfast. His cereal was soggy and there was bits in his juice. Harumph, said Pom Pom. Then things went from bad to worse. His toothbrush was too scratchy. His flannel was just freezing. And he couldn't do a thing with his hair. Harumph! said Pom Pom. After all that, it was time to go. Outside, the sun was too sunny and the birds were too noisy. Harumph, said Pom Pom. Have a lovely day, dear, said Pom Pom's mummy. Harumph, said Pom Pom. In the playground, everyone was having fun. All except Pom Pom. Fancy a kickabout? asked Buddy. No, huffed Pom Pom. Want to watch ants? asked Rocco. No, grumbled Pom Pom. Would you like to play catch? asked ba Baxter. No, shouted Pom Pom. Do you want to do skipping? asked Scout. Go! Away! yelled Pom Pom. And they did. Oh. Pom Pom didn't feel like shouting anymore. He felt sad and a bit silly. His friends had only tried to be nice. Oops, said Pom Pom. And off he went to find the others. Sorry, everyone said Pom Pom. That's okay, said everyone. I know, said Baxter. Let's play chase. I'll be chaser, said Buddy. Yay, said everyone. We can all be a little bit grumpy sometimes, just like Pom Pom. Just remember, if you feel like a bit of a harumph, make sure that you say sorry. Miss Rich will be reading our next Pom Pom story. Pom Pom the Champion.